Hello Exiles and Nephilim alike, my name is Snoo and this is a public service announcement video as well as a special treat I decided to save for a, a perfect moment and the perfect moment has come. So do stick around to the end of this video, I promise you're going to get a, a big kick out of it. Yes, I will be playing Diablo 4 just like so many of you and just like so many of you I'm totally on the hype train for it, nobody had to twist my arm. Me and Diablo, we go way, way back. I know a lot of you guys can relate. You know, if you're someone who likes Path of Exile, you're probably interested in trying Diablo 4. So I'm going to be right along with you. I'm going to be making some D4 content along the same lines of what the kind of stuff I already make. I'm sure it'll be things like build guides, uh, gold currency, earning guides, highlights. I'm going to be playing the game at a fairly high level, I suspect. I don't know yet. We'll see. Uh, Nothing beats a di new, brand new Diablo game PC launch experience, uh, as far as I'm concerned. The honey, the initial honeymoon phase that follows it, I know I'm going to get a solid three to six months out of this, at least, as far as, you know, the long-term future of the channel. I don't know. I suspect Path of Exile will probably have more staying power. Uh, so while this channel has been up to this point, totally dedicated as a POE content channel. It's not set in stone, and I'm just going to be playing whatever game I'm most interested in playing, and I know that Diablo and POE are so closely interconnected. Nobody's going to have a major problem with that, I'm sure. Uh, so if you are a POE content viewer and you're interested in Diablo content, well, that's good news for you, I guess. <laughs> if you're a Diablo content viewer exclusively, I suppose you got a new content creator on your midst, so do give a subscribe and uh, like if you're anticipating uh, watching some more of my content. It'll be some high quality stuff, I assure you. Much higher quality than the video I'm about to show you. <laughs> because for this special treat, I had to go deep into the Wayback Machine. Well, lucky we even have this. Uh, but what you're about to see is a much, much younger version of me who dipped my toe into streaming for the first time because I was doing things that nobody else was doing. Back in Diablo 3 vanilla days, this was hardcore. It was around the patch, the time they, they called it Monster Power, which is the same as Torment, except back in the day. So while nobody else was playing Inferno mode on hardcore, or hardly, uh, hardly anybody, it would have been unspeakable to be in playing Inferno mode, hardcore, Monster Power, shall we say 10. So what was I doing? I was doing Monster Power 10 Uber carries on Hardcore. <laughs> and I don't think anybody else was at the time. So that's what makes this uh, highlight video a little special, I guess. Please forgive me on the quality. Uh, my microphone was absolutely horrendous and I didn't even have a camera and my skills as a streamer were non-existent. <laughs> the, the kind of content that's gonna be coming out following this video will be much, much, much higher than what you're about to see i assure you anyway it's all for fun and it is thursday after all so enjoy this in immense throwback that i'm throwing your way i'll see you in the next video okay wait the cutscene. i'm starting this timer go here it is boys and girls my f scoundrel's already dead almost, that sucks. So my scoundrel slows and then I freeze. Let's see how much this uh, ceiling drop hurts me for. Never mind, he couldn't get it off. Fireball hit me for like a lot of my health. I appear to be doing pretty damn good uh, DPS on Siege Breaker, so that's a good sign. I have to be extra careful not to get near tornadoes whenever his pickup is off cooldown. As long as I do that, I should be fine. Some serious uh, life regen issues here. I'm not sure why. I have the. I may have to think about getting. Uh... I'm gonna have to think about getting a. Uh... It's more life on hit. Oh my god, that's not good. Uh, 
That's not good at all. It must be the, the bubbles. God damn it. Yeah, it's the bubbles. Alright, I figured that I should be fine. Somehow, I'm not... I can dodge the ceiling drop, but not if he picks me up, obviously. The amount of DPS he just did to me on that ceiling drop did actually make me a bit nervous. Not gonna lie. <laughs> I think what I need to do is... Just figure out how to get a little more life on hit on my gear. That's what I need to do. Alright, it should be easy cake from here. Shouldn't have any problems. When he did the ceiling drop on me, I also, I'm pretty sure that I did not dodge a single one of those. And like that one he just did on me, I dodged like two out of the four attacks he does. But I seriously went down to about 25 to 30 percent health. And I wasn't that scared about it, but I was scared because I was like, what if I can't pull my health back to full before he, uh, before they start really hurting me again. So. There we go. In game now. There they are. There they are. And that was three minutes and thirteen seconds.